On April 5th, 2020, just before the announcement of the state of emergency in Japan, Rakuten launched a new project in response to the coronavirus situation in the country. This rescue hotel project was led by Rakuten Travel, with the aim of protecting the safety of everyone in society. Securing medical supplies and facilities was crucial in preventing the spread of coronavirus. In light of this, Rakuten Travel stepped up to support hotels nationwide willing to accept patients with little to no symptoms. The project team focused on three main efforts. As the first step, Rakuten Travel's team of around 280 ITCs from across Japan made calls to hotels to identify those able to participate and created a list of such hotels. As a result of these efforts, they were able to create a list with over 850 hotels and more than 110,000 hotel rooms. It was challenging because we had to move quickly, but we didn't know what's correct. We were not sure the hotels needed to prepare to accept patients, and we were kind of contact to sign with the prefecture government. Everything was new to us, but we just kept working together with a team supporting the hotels. We created a manual for the hotels preparing to accept patients and help them with the preparations. For instance, we helped arrange companies to handle industrial waste from the patients and to disinfect the rooms after patient use, as well as other areas where the hotel staff tend to have less time to handle. The lack of staff on site was a true challenge. While assisting the hotels in the area I oversaw, I even did a bit of DIY and created partitions to separate the patients. I think going out to help out at the hotels and reflecting what I learned on site in the menu has allowed me to discover and share information that is more useful to everyone. Thanks to the hard work of the ITCs, Hotel 2135, a hotel in Aomori Prefecture and the first participant of the project, was able to start accepting patients within around one month after the project began. Rakuten Travel also worked closely with the Japan Tourism Agency, as well as other governmental entities and prefectural governments, to share information in a timely manner. I think we were able to provide values to hotel, which are unique to Rakuten as a private enterprise. For instance, when creating contracts for the prefecture government and the hotels regarding patient acceptance, we were able to use the template we had from the first hotel in Aomori prefecture. This sharing of information helped speed up our process. And my team and I often receive consultation calls from the Japan Tourism Agency and Tokyo Metropolitan Government and the local government, sometimes even at night. It makes me very honored of their trust, while feeling a greater sense of responsibility at the same time. Rakuten Travel's engineering team also responded with speed in terms of development. They were able to create a system allowing local governments to easily search and book a room at a participating hotel in less than three days. Rakuten Travel engineers are used to a speedy development environment. Since we are always involved in multiple projects, we have become quite first in customizing projects in development. The system is being utilized by many gov governmental entities, such as the Ministry of Health, Labor and Welfare, to monitor all hotels open to receiving patients. I am very proud that we are able to provide a user-friendly system in such a short amount of time. Every team member of this effort joined because they share their mission to contribute to society and make meaningful impact in these urgent times. Recently, Rakuten Travel has added a new function allowing users to check coronavirus countermeasures implemented by hotels. This know-how is also being utilized to prepare for a potential second wave of the pandemic, as well as establishing a new normal for the travel industry 